Well, in his debut novel, 19, Daryl Jenny weaves his real life experiences of modeling in the 80s into an inspiring story you will never forget. He lives in Connecticut with his wife and seven children, and we want to welcome you. Thank you so much for coming here. Thank you for having me, Marisol. It's, it's great to meet you in person. So. We're billing you as this model, author, <laughs> writer. Back in the day. Back in the, the golden <laughs> age of modeling. Right. Uh, but I sort of want to back into this story because you're wearing this neck brace. You had this <laughs> this accident. I wonder if you could tell us about it. Yeah, just quickly. Uh, August 18th, I was down in North Carolina finishing up our vacation and just caught, we were boogie boarding. It was the end of the day. Just uh, the tide was going, coming in, and the wave was bigger than I thought, and got under the wave, so it sort of picked me up and dumped me on my head, and uh, injured my spine, mm -hmm. um, right, you know, right about the base of your neck, yeah, and uh, paralyzed me for a short period of time. My and my son, thank goodness, was there, and uh, Nicholas, and uh, he was able to get to me take me out of the water and as I was you know on the beach you know some people came and yeah. helped out that was awesome um, feelings started coming back but got very lucky because sure. uh, the, the there was significant damage to the spinal cord but it sort of kept you know kept all the the nerve Everything was yeah, Everything's intact. good. A little bit of pain in my you left were, hand. You were obviously <laughs> meant to remain here I think on so. this yeah. earth. No, which, there was, uh, something, there was right, something going on there. Right, yeah. which uh, brings me to uh, your book, which is, I've only read a couple of chapters, awesome. and it is, um, I'm a speed reader, you see. Oh, no. okay. <laughs> right before <laughs> um, we get on. You talk about uh, being a model and um, just so many different life lessons from this nonfiction right. book. Tell us about that. Well, um, one of my inspirations to write 19 was that there have been uh, multiple books written by female models. Mm -hmm. There is one that I know of written by a male model. And um, after reading that, I thought, wow, you know what? Uh, I actually, ha coincidentally, happened to be a guy that I worked quite a bit with uh, back in the 80s. Mm -hmm. And I said, that, that's sort of a, a caricature of what it was like. And I said, it'd be great to write something about really what the it was real, like. The real, real right. nitty gritty. The real mean, yeah. meaning, you know, the, the, the good and the bad. Some, mm -hmm. Someone described it in an article, the good, the bad, and the ugly. <laughs> and. Uh, it, you know, and, and, and just sort of, uh, you know, warts and all, scars mm -hmm. and all. Sure. And that was, the, that was the motivation in writing it. I started out writing it to be sensationalist. What are people going sure. to like? And I didn't like it. And so <laughs> I threw that away. And then I started on, uh, you know, a real story. And I actually thought that people would be the least interested oh, absolutely. in the flashbacks and sort of his life. Yeah. And people were going, wow, that... You know, that really was inspiring. And also just the whole normal people judge a book by its cover. That sure. whole, whole Well, concept. and there's so many different ways that we can talk about this. I mean, look at these pictures. I wonder, <laughs> what do you think when you look at that picture? Um, I think it's really the, is an interesting picture. I think that was one of the things I liked the most about working with some of these photographers is they, you know, one of the compliments and criticisms that I often got was, you look different in every picture. Mm -hmm. So they were like, what are we going to get when you show up? Oh, right. The photographers that had the vision and had the, you know, you know, the creativity and the artistry, I would say, loved that. The, the photographers were like, I just want to stand behind the camera right. and take and, some pictures. And like, capture, who are right. we going to get? And capture Daryl. Yeah. So the book is called 19. You are working on 20, of yes. course. <laughs> yeah. I have started on the sequel. Uh, it does take continue where um, it's a fictional novel based on a true story. Mm -hmm. So uh, the sequel uh, 20 picks up. Where, where left 19 off. left off. I will say the last sentence of 19, you do want more. So. Oh, okay. Yeah, that, we've heard that a lot. That's hunky been a male <laughs> model of the golden age of uh, the 80s, also gifted writer. Thank and you. Thank by you the very way, much. father of seven children. Right. I can barely do two. <laughs> well, seven gets. You know, especially the younger three. We have, you know, they're really uh, three, four, five, but two of them just turned uh, five and six. Oh. So now it's three, five, six. Daryl, thank so, you so much. Thank you very much. Great pleasure. We look forward to your next book. And thank come you. back and visit us. And again. they can find it at DarylJanny.com if there they want to look it up. Thank you so much for being here with thank us. Thank you, Marisol.